16 months. That's how long it's been since the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra played for people inside of the Meyerhof. Tonight, they mark the return of an indoor audience. A triumphant American song leading off the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra's first performance for an in-person audience. Tonight we have a jazz-inspired program to welcome you back in these beautiful cushy seats here. Since March of last year. And I have missed it, so this is, this is a real treat to be able to get out be to the Meyerhof again. I play my records, but it's just not the same. We have uh, real culture again, so it's exciting for Baltimore. The show already a hot ticket in town. Our summer with the symphony is completely free, but at the same time, it's completely sold out. Bringing in loyal supporters. I was concerned about the impact of the pandemic on the orchestra, but I'm glad they've managed to make it through. To fill in seats with reasonable distance from each party and a capacity limit. It'll be a smaller audience, but um, yeah, I don't think that's going to change the performance. An audience with ears and eyes open. Nothing's the same thing as a live performance. For another night <laughs> of classical music. It sold out in four or five days from when we announced it, and I think that speaks to everyone's energy and excitement to be back. BSO is good for Baltimore, and Baltimore is good for the BSO. So um, I'm glad they endured, and I look forward to their future growth. And while the summer shows are all sold out, organizers say there's still tickets available for shows later this year. In Midtown, I'm Trey Ward, WBAL-TV, 11 News.